I will be demonstrating how to connect a SIMCOM 808 board with Arduino Mega board. So we have our SIMCOM board here, a couple of things. This is this place is for us to insert a normal SIM card. This is GSM antenna, this is GPRS antenna. GPRS antenna is something like this. You can connect it here and you can lock it. These are the pins that we have for serial communication with the mega board. The first one is ground, second one is transfer TX, second third one is receive RX, fourth one is VCC, then we have mic controls and other things. Currently we are only worried about the first four pins and that too only TX and RX. So this TX and RX is responsible for making serial communication with Arduino mega board. Arduino mega board response has these pins TX1, RX1. So this is one difference that you can find between an Arduino no board and Arduino Mega board. Arduino Mega has dedicated pins for hardware serial communication. So like here you can see 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. This is uh, RX0, RX, TX0 which is called serial. So this serial is for communication with your PC. This will be referred as serial 1, TX1, RX1. And this is for serial communication with this SIMCOM board. Now we make our connections. So this yellow we will be using to refer the TX pins of SIMCOM board. So we connect it here. Here goes the connection. So it is placed with TX. We have a green jumper wire. This one. So the green jumper wire goes to RX. This is just a convention that I use to avoid confusion with my pins. Now remember one thing when you are connecting to the mega board, the TX is connected to RX and RX is connected to TX. So that is the alternate connections. Otherwise you will run into a situation where this LED will a status LED and network LED will blink continuously for three four times and then the power will go off and it will reboot. I'll be showing that issue as well. So first of all we connect it to green one to TX not this TX, TX18 that is our serial one and yellow one to RX of Mega 